Hey, what's good, people? This is Tim from Tim's Tech Blog. Right now, I'm just going to give you guys a really quick unboxing of the Blue Yeti Pro and also a quick hands on review of it. So, let's just go ahead and get into it. This microphone retails for about $249, and I just picked it up at my local Apple store. So, let's just go ahead and get into this. Now, I'm really excited about having this because as you guys may or may not know, I do, kind of, I do music stuff so I record a lot of artists and things of that nature and right now I've, I have this um, Behringer B2 Pro studio condenser mic that I've had for several several years and so this is a very very big upgrade for me. Now uh, some of its highlights just to kind of go through them right now is that it has a built in mute button, um, it's got triple capsule and it records in stereo. You have your mic gain control actually on the front of it, and you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and get into it and read the boxing stuff later. But um, here we go. Oh. You have your USB cable there. Your proprietary XLR cable. I think it's proprietary because it has more pins right here. But anyway, it's got the left and the right. So put that off to the side. Some cool little Yeti people. My dog Jordan chilling in the background right there. If you can't see him, we focused. All right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, so let's just go ahead and go around the microphone. So as you can see, it has its own little built-in stand here. It's like really, really hefty. It's got this nice rubber padding on the bottom, or not rubber, but kind of like a, a foam padding on the bottom. You have the USB port there, the um, attachment to attach it to like a stand, proprietary connector there <clears throat> that um, the stereo XLRs plug into. Then you have the built-in microphone monitoring system there. Well, that's where the headphones plug into. Oh. Looks very, very nice. The mic feels itself very, very solid. Well, the stand feels solid. The mic itself does too. Blue is a very, very solid mic company. Uh, this microphone has high expectations and I'm betting that it's going to sound really, really good. And next up, I'm just going to do some really quick audio tests with it and include it in this video. Alright, so right now I'm definitely recording using the Yeti because the quality went up a whole bunch. Don't mind the footage, it's just slowed down random stuff so I can give myself time to speak. Right now I'm recording in four, and one of the four um, pickup patterns that this thing offers. Let me just go through those real quick. One is stereo, which is right now. The other is cardioid, omni, and bi-directional. So I'm just going to flip through them really, really quick. So right now I'm in stereo, and if you hear me go to the right, you'll hear me move and give a nice perspective of where I am at on this microphone so I'm moving right to left and now right back in the middle this is gonna be most useful when doing product reviews because again it gives you a nice perspective of where I'm at on film I'm gonna flip it over here to Omni which is basically all three of these capsules that this has is recording all around the microphone so I'm snapping all around and you can hear it um, that's good for when you're doing just like a I don't know like a room recording of something if I flip it, flip it over here to cardioid, it's just one capsule in the front picking up and blocking out all the other surrounding noises, which is great for doing vocals in a music piece or just recording voiceover straight on because it drowns everything out. I'm going to flip it over here to bi-directional, which is basically the front and back capsules are picking up right now. So this is good if you have like a singer right up front and then like a guitar player in the back. So my finger snapping is the back. You hear how it's in perfect everything. So that's pretty much it. The video ran out. I don't know what I'm going to... So that's pretty much it. You know, if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure that you hit me up. I know this is a very, very um, uh, expensive investment, but for me, it's definitely worth it. I'm going to use it a bunch. And, um, you know, if you have any questions, just hit me up in a comment. I will answer it. And thanks for tuning in for this review. You guys have a nice day. Make sure you check me out on GadgetBeats.com. And make sure you're following me on Twitter at Tim's Tech Blog. All right, peace.